Peace, peace, peace. Divine understanding, born of law. So in reality, what we want is, we want the reality of like the God said, how you see the days of the reality. And the other God said, yeah, how do you see the days mathematic. And all of these add up to be the same manifestation of the mathematical equation within life itself. Not really complicated. Very simple, very simple in simplicity is very simple in its own simplicity. Life. Even though life in and of itself is very complex, right? But the ideology behind food, clothing, and shelter is life. So if you're going to be the one producing life, dealing with procreation, man and woman, make a child, then the knowledge, the wisdom, and the understanding will enable you to hit the freedom, justice, and equality. If we keep traveling down this road where we're afraid to say to our other brothers and sisters within the knowledge of self world, um, no, you're corrupt. You're corrupting the leadership. You're stealing the money or whatever it is you're doing that is not putting us where we should be in 2023. All right. Once we have identified the problem. So we already know what the problem is, right? We already identified it. Corruption. So corruption at its lowest and highest levels within the community of the original people who have lambs, wool, the diaspora, and the world over. Uh, The world over, the whole diaspora, uh, the planet Earth, Gaia, mother, mother, our mother. She, we live on her. Mm. Um, just because the devil uh, wants to say hurricanes are men and women, but nature says it's a woman. And so we're going to go with uh, nature. We're going to go with Mother Gaia's ideologies. We're going to let go of the devil. So when 20 said for us to let go of the devil, didn't it? And all the other major players, they all was asking us to let go of the devil in one way or another. And in certain forms and fashions, they tried, strived. Some tried because they didn't, some of us failed to um, get to that realization of I'm not going to uh, adhere to the devil's teachings and I'm not going to bear witness to the devil's philosophy. So when you get to that level where you say you don't bear witness to the devil's teachings and you don't bear witness to the devil's philosophy, now you have to find out because we're born in the wilderness of North America, Central America, South America, uh, Alaska, to Chile, we're born here, and, and even if you in Africa, see, in Africa, the colonization is a little different than it is here. They'll still have direct lineage to their language, or to our language, but we won't have direct lineage to our language. With Ancestry.com, we can connect with everything else. You can pretty much figure out where, you, where your people are now. Not your direct people, but you'll be able to know where your tribes are. And when you go see them, you'll see yourself, your features, because each tribal has certain features. That's why they know who you are easier than you know, right? And even though when you're online and you're over here in the wilderness in North America, you think your, your tribe won't accept you when you come home, they will. They know. Especially when you come home with resources in your brain. And that's why if you use the lessons by the time it's time for you to make a quick run to home, you should already have your trade and profession already. You might get over there and they say, damn, you want to stay here with that trade or this, that, and the third? Because it's a give and take situation. You know, the whole nation of lamb's wool is under the thumb of the European nation. 
Uh, the, other, the other day I had said Benjamin Franklin. What well, wasn't the other day? It was on one of the videos we was building on. I was saying Benjamin Franklin and um, George Washington and the whole lot. Uh, what was his day? The guy that uh, Thomas Jefferson and all of them, right? And I said they were Europeans. So this European from America says, oh, I was done when he said European because Benjamin Franklin's not from Europe. He was from America. And so that's when my mind went right to how the uh, lessons had said that they thought of themselves as the Americans and you as other than. But the, the reality is you're not even really a European because you're not the first European. You're not the first or nothing on the planet Earth. Let's start there. And then let's go finish. Who is the first on the planet Earth? Who circumnavigated the whole planet? Who built here and built monuments and everything? Even them castles, even all those monuments they be trying to attribute to Greece and Rome and lies. I would say, mm, based on my research, 75% of those structures were there when they moved into them. And that's the world over. 75% of the monuments and structures were already there when these other nations moved in. That's my word is born. Did you not hear Khaled Muhammad? Go get that album by, um, what's his name? Ice Cube, right? Is it, I mean, you can get Khaled Muhammad himself, because I'm sure there's videos. But there was this, there was this uh, album. What was albums back then? I had, had, I had the, uh, I had the cassette, right? And it was, um, it was Ice Cube. Um, death, death something, death certificate, I think it was. That shit was so long ago, G. Uh, like the early 90s, 89, 90, 91. I think it was, I think we was listening to it in 91, 90, 91, something like that, right? And, um, the point I'm making is, um... Khalid Muhammad and knowledge itself had hit another uh, plateau. Not really a plateau. It had bridged its head up again out of the submarine. Because it was, knowledge itself acts like a submarine when it's in waves. So you'll think it's not there, but it'll be hidden under the water. And then it'll pop up. Europeans don't like it. Shoot off a couple of, they'll be trying to depth charge you when you in down under. But we go so deep that their depth charges explode before it could ever get to us because it can't take the pressure of how deep we can go. That's a metaphor. You feel me? But anyway, we're getting back to we don't be saying nothing to each other when we as long as the group of bears witness to it then we go with stuff that's not right and exact. Like if the group don't say nothing, everybody goes with it and still they don't say nothing because the group didn't say anything. But if the, some of the people in the group that has prominent power say something about something, then, then the subordinate to the group, groupies and all them, Everybody that's trying to ride with that, then they say something too. I see it happen. Especially when they don't know who it is that's saying something that the group says is not, they don't agree with. And that's in anything you would. I see it in every group of culture, creed, whatever the case might be. All of them do it. They all do that. Right, and so what you what you, what happens is that's how you that's how um what do they call it splinter groups and all that that's how that starts happening. 
because somebody want to do the science harder than the somebody else wants to do it. They want to go all out hard, hard, hard. You'll see it. Watch. In the Orthodox Islam, the Muslims, right? Um, the Sunni and the Shia will give you a good example of that split. But they both read Quran, right? They both bear witness to the Prophet Muhammad. Peace and blessings of Allah be upon him, right? They both bear witness to Esau. They both bear witness to Abraham, right? They do. They both make Salat, Wudu, the pillars, um, Zakat. Uh, ayats, ayats, ayats and surahs, hadith, ah, 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 right? Even though it's, I forget the name of it, but when you want to, like the wives of the prophet, one of the wives, I think the youngest wife, she wrote hadith and <coughs> they'll be deep like that. <coughs> All right. Depending on whose side you on, who, who deep. But at the end of the day, they'll have the four Khalis, the first four Khalis, and then there's a breakdown on that right there, right? And so I say that to say, when you look at Elijah Muhammad's temple, you'll see similar, it's not exactly the same, but you'll see the breakdown, ba 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 ba, and ah 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 ah, and then boom, then you go, uh, W.D. Ah, ah, ah. And then we go, Elijah, and brrr, ah, what went down when them years went down. And then you'll go from Elijah 34 to 75, right? Ah, ah, ah. All that, Malcolm, boom, all that that went in between that time frame, which was still based on what 120 supreme wisdom, this, that, and the third, whatever the case may be, how you see it, right? Okay, so now we bringing ourselves up to we nowadays. And so the remedy, he said, oh, well, well, what's the remedy in this, that, and the third with the police and this? I, I like keeping it real, dude. The best remedy a law had was don't even let them get their hands on you because once they got their little greedy hands on you, you kind of in their hand. And he said he even had a remedy for that. Just do it at your time and then you come home. But the ideal remedy, if you listen to the degrees and the way they are made manifest and the things that he said, which we got that from him, but... They all said pretty much the same thing. All of them. Right? If we do two in the right, five in the left, they, don't they all pretty much say the same thing? It's really just five. It's those five that really say everything. And then the two on the right are just high octaves because they got it from them. And so they were able to... Um, it's, but they the same people in the five. They just both have a seven or they have nations behind them and you have like that. Because you have people like Martin Luther King and Malcolm X who don't really say have a nation. Like there's no actual group that way. Like they may have the AOAA and this, that, and the Christian organization, blah, 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 blah. But it's not the same as how Elijah got a nation like of Elijah people that they really down with Elijah like that. Because they quote those lessons too. They're running out of um, well their numbers are I don't know if they're increasing or decreasing as far as quoting lessons. But it appears as if it's not increasing. And that the only one that's left with the increase on 120 now is us. I don't, 
I, I'm not saying they not that I might be mistaken, but if you can, if there isn't, if as a group they not doing it, as as a group, that is like our foundation. Like, I'm gonna need you to cook those lessons, like Kia said. I'm gonna need you to cook those lessons, like I hear what you're saying. But Divine asks you to cook the degree. Can you cook the degree and we'll go from there? And then if you, I, mean, I don't know, you can't cook the degree, where does that put you at? That's what I'm saying. So, <laughs> like I said, they'll be doing something this, they'll be saying, oh, you shouldn't do this, that, and a third, right? But at the same time, they shouldn't do this, that, and a third. What they doing wrong? Like, not like, and nobody's really. Dude, I be trying to do 120, and I say try. I meant to say that. Because I be striving, but try is to fail, and meaning that do you do 120 the whole 100%? You do the whole 100% mathematics, alphabets. 120 in year 12 Jews. You do all of that, right and exact, all the way, every time. Ah, ah, ah. What? No. No, you don't. Oh, well, I ain't going to say that. There might be a motherfucker doing it, like maybe a baby. <laughs> a baby is doing it. You have to corrupt the baby. They're coming out doing 120. When they're in the womb, in the cell, and ah, 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 they're doing 120. You put... Not writing exact things in your mouth as the mother and to get to the baby. And the father would have already did his not writing exact shit and got it made in his spinal fluid and the sperm and all that. He would have already did it before it dropped in the womb. And then she would have already, whatever damage she would have did to the egg. That's why it also works in reverse. If you were plant-based, writing exact plant-based, and she's right an exact plant base. And everybody that we together in that order, because the order would have been, it would have been, what did he say? Good orderly direction. So those people that was in that order, because they all got together, it's been proven. It can done. It can be done. Just look at the degree of Law 360. It shows it right there how you do it. But I've seen other degrees that's from other people, other groups, other manifestations all the way back to 50,000 years ago. Lessons like that. And so in those degrees, it says that. It says for you to take your um, seed to the next level. And so you're doing it. All the men are doing it. And all the women, women are doing it. And so when they have their seeds, they, all the seeds are doing it. It'll keep elevating us to the next level. Like, I mean, just think what we doing as a people and we eating like the devil says eat. And we still, these children are coming with their eyes open and everything. Because, you know, that's what it says. I mean, I know people be saying, oh, I don't bear witness to scripture anymore because the child was with me one day and she told me that the reason she didn't bear witness to scripture anymore was because um, LGP people are nice. I'm saying, I don't understand how that goes together, but okay, I didn't say nothing because the hell was I going to say? There wasn't no answer for that. She was making a statement. She didn't ask me a question. So I didn't say anything. So when they said, well, why didn't you? He said, because why didn't I just gave you the answer before time. But he said, why didn't you um, dispute it? And I'm saying, what dispute was that? She was telling me how she saw it and what her feelings were and not. She wasn't asking me a question. She made a statement. Okay, I wasn't. I don't have to make a statement in back of your statement. I can just listen to your statement and absorb it, and and do the knowledge to it. I still don't have to do no wisdom. Well, I gotta say something back. You ask me a question, and I want to answer it. I can answer it, depending on who you are. Whether I want to answer the question or not, and that's how it really works, right? 
Now, if we're on the same square and we're talking about we building and adding on and you asking me a question, that's not the same as we having a conversation, somebody talking or not, and they not in this. What are you talking about? So anyway, that was the point I was making was people be having their own opinion or how they see it and what they see is what's... Well, if they're not asking me a question, why do I have to tell them that I don't see it that way? I don't got to tell you that. I don't care how you see it. That shit ain't... If it's not really affecting my money. Now, of course, when it's your siblings or your children or your parents, it's a closer hit. But in reality, and in this new planet, the way America is set up, that could not still not affect you. It might affect you and you be saying, damn, they done fucked up and now my next generation ain't ain't in the sit ain't in and I know the next generation ain't like I told the guard, I said, gee, we're all a victim of <coughs> pardon me. We're all a victim of the wilderness of North America, February 20th, 1934. We're all a victim of what went down in America doing FDR and, and, and IRS and, uh, and the 1916 part with the, with, the, with the tax codes and then the, the gold standard in, in the 30s and then the New Deal, and then we were taking off the silver standard by in the 70s after Kennedy and all that. Because I got silver certificates that was handed down and across and all that and up. Down, across, and up. Those how I got them. They were handed that way and this, that, and the third, whatever the case may be, right? But I'm saying you have forgot the face of your father and then... I don't know how people think that they could forget the face of their father. And then say, well, I still want you to support what I'm doing. And then they, f- okay, look. When Lot and uh, Sarah and Abraham and Hagar and the Moabite daughters that end up being the Moabites and I, 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 right. All that was going down almost right simultaneous and the two angels and Abraham is talking to a law in the tent and the law sends the two angels on uh, and uh, depending on which side you on is a law or it's IHVA, Yahweh, whichever, whichever one is still the same one God, like one can divide in anything evenly, all right. And so, because they be saying, oh, I don't like the word of law. But the word of law been around long before the Arabs got a hold of it and started taking and doing whatever they're doing. That's just like uh, the old Ethiopian side of of the Coptic and the Gnostics and all and then they, what they consider Christianity. Uh, 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 right? That's not the same one that the Europeans got, and that sure ain't the ones that y'all are practicing over here in the Woodlands, North America. How do I know? Because you've got King James Version. You're not using the Ethiopian, Coptic, uh, Gnostic. You're not doing that. You're killing me. Stop fronting and trying to connect it. Like, well, I know Jesus is black. Yeah, we all know he's black, but your ass, the congregation has the more power than the individual, and you by yourself. Uh, might be trying to act like you worshiping black Jesus, maybe, but the people who you with, they're not. The songs that you singing on, on the radio with those uh, Christian songs, and all them think Jesus white. I go, you say, oh, they don't think Jesus white. That's the fuck they do. All you gotta do is is go to their spot. I mean, and go where they at. Go to their church. Show me where it ain't. Get the fuck out of here. They got the white Jesus, the white angels, the white everything European. They still modified their shit behind the European. That's my word is born. So I'm not going to be... So you can't be having two masters. You can't have the true and living master, but you faking and fabricating with the fake one over here while you trying to be a... European following European codes, then the next thing hits is they they give up their hair. Now they don't want to do lamb's wool and it's appalling to themselves. Even when 
they see their own hair, whether they man, woman, or child, they think it's it's revolting to them because that's who made you hate your hair. Who made you hate your features? See? And then it's just a fucking domino effect in back of that. Like, even at the Just Cyber Born, I be seeing this Wizard Myself Divine Cyber Master. She be like one of the only ones I see in the natural look. And I be going to myself, see, that's the one that's the got her shit more in tune with Mother Gaia. Y'all other fucking, y'all fucking up everything. Why don't you listen? Why are you still chasing after the gods of Europe whom you know nothing of? They never look out for you. They might help you cheer up the original family. You see, that shit didn't work with all that fake-ass child support, family court, divorce, welfare, food stamps, EBTs, and whatever else the fuck the government did to help you kick the black man in the curve. And then the penal institution and the... Yo, gee, I was doing the knowledge, right? And the guard was, t- I didn't even know this. That's what was so astonishing. I know it sounds like, damn, man, I was naive of for you not to know that. Yes, it was in that particular area. I, I, don't, I didn't study that degree. I didn't even know that happened to even know to look at that. That shows you how that happens to everybody. There's certain things you didn't look at because you didn't even know you needed to look at it. If you already think you know what was going on, you might not look further in to see. So anyway, long story short, he said they do time up north. When they come home, they can't even get, you can't rent an apartment, you can't buy a house, you can't incorporate, you can't vote. And people won't give you a job because you got to tell them you got a felon. That's five hits right there. And there's other shit that comes in back of it, you know. They know more about if it's if you in the cycle, you know really what they doing. And the people call it vi they gonna violate me. When I used to hear them saying that when I was at Beth in Atlanta, I kinda understood it, but I didn't understand it. Because I didn't live it, so I didn't really know what the fuck they was talking about, even though I knew they was going to go back up north. But I didn't know to the extent until I knew somebody personally, a few people personally, that what they was doing. Like when I was, when Lay came home, I could see it because I know Lay. And when Justice came home, Under could see him because he, that's who we was around the guards and shit. So anyway, that gave us another insight on what they're doing. Like, people don't understand what, when they say prison complex system. And then if you look at that degree, I gave you that degree, right? If you look on one of my posts on either, it's both. I do Instagram and I do the Facebook posts, those solid ones. with, And you'll see where I show to that that, uh, mechanical wheel of the different components that they use within the structure of Yaku's first rules and regulations, including all those enforced by manufacturing the devil. You see it say... Doctors, ministers, nurses, and cremators, right? And then they always, people always say it's supposed to be, it is five, and it's Yaku. Just because Yaku ain't here physically, his manifestation is being made manifest. Dude, if you think his manifestation ain't really banging you in your head, and I don't give a fuck if you black, brown, red, yellow, white, you getting hit in the head by the colonizer so hard that you don't even know he's banging you. The only colonizers that's getting good making out of it is the ones that are the 10% and work for the 10% because everybody else is pretty much getting screwed. (laughs) Even if you're in the 5% and you got your shit together economically, right? And you have paper. You go to the Bahamas and Africa and 
South America, Rio de Janeiro. You, you, you good. You got money. You made it. You did the traded profession. I, 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 and you still sitting around like the rest of us, waiting on all your people to wake up and you, you know, and everybody come together and we destroy the devil in one day without falling victim to the devil civilization. We all waiting, right? We like sitting around going, damn, when this shit gonna go down? But if you look at the lessons and the degrees, you'll say, oh, in the eyes of Allah, a day is a thousand years, so. The end of the double civilization, 1914, 1913, 1915, give or take a few, depending on if you're using the Asiatic calendar or you're using Gregorian, ah, ah, ah. You see what I'm saying? You're catching it now, right? Anyway, long story short, when the shit's coming through and the cusp goes through, the cusp alone is about 120 years. What do you want from me? So we talking a thousand years. Are we like 100 and something years in the hit? Boy, this is your chance to really make your mark in, in the universe and make it when you hit the motherfucking plane of existence. You should be hitting this plane of existence with your feet on the ground running because it's on and popping up in this baby. And so we have to make sure that those in the physical composition that are coming eight and nine generations after we have already left. Not eight and nine generations from now while we're here. But you, you got to be prepared for the eight and nine generations that are coming after you have already physically left the physical plane of existence, a motor vehicle of life. You left the motor vehicle of life. You return to the essence as the lessons would state it. All right. Well, who is that mystery guy? Well, you know damn well you ain't in that body no more. Now, Amy saying, well, where did he go? No one never came back and told us whether he lied or not. But this I do know. You will fucking figure it out. Or you won't figure it out. It could be either one. You can figure it out or you won't figure it out. Uh, when the physical composition ceases to function. See, that's the shit. When the physical composition sees the function. Well, I can say if you can read the old ancient scriptures and books and science and ah, 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 and you'll get a pretty good idea. But think of it from my perspective is. My perspective is, well, where the hell was you at when you jumped in that air particles and a clot of blood and attached yourself to the U.S. world? Wherever the fuck you was at when you got in there then? More than likely, that's where you're going back to. So I don't know if it's why people are so afraid as if, yeah, because they know this is all the life they got, and they ain't trying to let it go. So, all right, on that note alone, I say let's step our game up, because if we don't step our game up, they're trying to snuff us out, even though nature is against everything that's not right and exact. That's why it destroys procreation on certain things and... It makes things go extinct, and it does it its own self. If you don't, you know, I'm not saying that the European don't be doing it too. He be wiping out whole tribes and genetic lines and the whole nine yard. But then, nature be doing it back to him. He just don't understand that nature be doing stuff to him, but it does it on such a long scale that you can't really see it. You can't pinpoint it. Now, somebody who has knowledge of stuff will say, "Yeah, it looks like he's making his procreation go away." Like, his procreation is not at the standard that he would like it to be. And the only way he can repair it is to make amends with all of the, as we call it ourselves in this new world order, we say black, brown, red, yellow, white. Okay, so say everybody in here know what we understand. The people who are the real white people, not the buffer white people that's in between white people and yellow people. And then you got yellow people and then red, then brown and then black. Okay, so the people that are in, the, the pink people, all the way pink nipples, pink genitalia, they got honorary white people that's like Mediterraneans and all of them, um, Arabs and all of them be honorary white people because they're amalgamated. So, they'll be mad at all the Mediterranean people, but all the Europeans that are European, no matter what denomination they are, whether they in today's modern world, it could be atheist or Muslim or Islamic or they might even be uh, some other Hindu or something like that. But 
You know if they black, brown, red, yellow, white. You know if they're into thinking that the European is right in his ideology that he's the superior. And, and then his ideology on one cell animals are inferior and complex organisms are superior. And that the top of the food chain is the lion and all that kind of shit. The way he teaches that, that, that superior and inferior going down. He don't teach it as a circle. He teach it as a line going up and down. And he at the top. I'm the top of it all, right? All right. So you see what that shit gets the planet into. Uh, we like this right now. It's Sodom and Gomorrah. That's why when the little girl said to me that just because people were nice that it's not the war Armageddon, that the scriptures ain't right and exact as... Well, I wouldn't say that they're totally right and exact because they've been mixed, diluted, and tampered with. Just the fact that we use the English language tells us everything's been mixed, diluted, and tampered with because it wasn't even written in that language, so you lose in the translation anyway. But to say that the manifestation of the creator of procreation is not right and exact, well, I would just say if we take 500 people and we say, I want 500 women. And you put 500 women on an island. And you come back in 100 years, there'll be bones on that island. And if you take 500 men and you put 500 men on an island and you come back in 100 years, there'll be bones on that island. But if you take 500 women and I wouldn't want to really go with 500 men, but if you wanted to say everybody going to have one wife, one man, uh, 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 that would make gene pool too fast. You shouldn't do it that way. You should do more like 1,000 women and 300 men. Then you won't have no fighting and killing up. And if you said polygamy, maybe 400 men. 400 men versus... 1,000 women and polygamy is right and exact. And we'll use the Old Testament's version. You can have up to 20 wives, but you'd have to, everybody would have to be right and exact because we wouldn't want prostitution and we wouldn't want women taking other men, women's husbands and all that other crazy shit that America liked to happen. So we could have concubines and you could have wives and everything would be right and exact, but that would be like Eden. But we, if we had... If we was all eating right and exact and not a bunch of acting like we animals doing what animals do, we're the higher of the species. We're supposed to be caretakers of the planet. Why are you a murderer, raper, pillager, pedophile, and all that other crazy shit that goes on that side? And what else goes with all of that? You know what goes with all of that. And so how could that possibly be right and exact if all of that world is on that side? And all the procreation and everything that's right and exact is on this side. See? Anyway, divine understanding, born of law. You know how we do it. We set the record straight.